Hello guys, welcome to this course on Terraform. My name is Sajish and this video we will see sum or option that we can use with count. So in previous video, so we did the deployment using count option and we use count as to for deploying to EC2 instance. And we have a one variable count.index so that we can use here and for testing I'm adding one option like tag. So there is an option tags where you can define your tags for that resource. So tags equal to opening and closing brace in between you can add your tag key and name. So I'm adding the tag as name and uh, some name. Okay, so the, I'm writing as test VM and then followed by the variable count.index. So that has to be inside opening and closing brace and then $1. And we use count.index. So count.index will be starting from zero, and for each instance, it will increment. So for example, first instance it will be having the value zero, second instance one, and so on. So here we have uh, two instances, and uh, go ahead and do the terraform init. So terraform init do the initial initialization, and it download the plugins needed for this deployment based on the provider that we defined. So once that is done, so we can validate our script using Terraform validate. We should get a success message and that means our code is correct. Then we can do the actual deployment using Terraform apply. So Terraform apply will do the actual deployment. And once prompted, type yes and then enter. So this start the actual deployment. So open AWS console and here you can see two instances are getting deployed and instance name are testvm0 and testvm1 and if you go to the tag option you can see the tag name as testvm0 and for the second one it's testvm1 and uh, it, it may take some time to do the actual deployment and uh, once this is done uh, I'm just modifying this tag uh, to add some more uh, key and value and I'm adding the tag key as created by and hard coding or writing some value as like Hadoop engineering okay so it's just an update that we are making here so if we uh, do a terraform plan we can see whether it's uh, doing a new deployment or making these changes so again the terraform plan also may take some time and uh, that also depends on your internet bandwidth so here you can see uh, plan zero to add and two to change and zero to destroy it. so that means it's only making changes to the existing resources so that is why it's showing two to change then do the actual deployment using terraform apply so terraform apply will make changes to these uh, resources so once prompted type yes and then enter so again it takes some time to do the deployment once it's getting deployed we can verify that from uh, this aws console uh, go there and check you can see the new tag also so that's it about the deployment using count and we can see how to use count.index hope you enjoyed the learning so please give me a like and positive comment if you like this video. Also share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.